Hi, Ida. Hi, Julia. I'm super excited to chat with you today in relation to the announcement of your Series A. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Um, we at Univik are, of course, uh, thrilled to be a part of your continued journey. Um, Agrina is really in the intersection between two themes that means a lot to us. Um, one of them is the food sector, uh, where we just started to dip our toes in the upper part of the ecosystem. And the other one is sustainability, um, which has been an integral part of our strategy for a very long time. Um, but I will actually leave it over to you and let you tell us the story about Agrina. What is Agrina and why did you found the company? Yes, thank you very much. So Agrina is a company that's driving sustainability in agriculture, both from a financial, but also very much from a sustainability perspective. Um, so what we want to do is enable the farmers to really drive sustainability. Uh, so we've created a carbon certificate program that works as a funding mechanism to allow farmers to transition into regenerative practices. Yeah, you can say that we want to be the carrot instead of the stick for making farmers change practices so that they become more climate friendly and help all of us because they can actually store carbon in the soil and take it out of the atmosphere, the CO2. Mm. So, so at the heart of, uh, of your model is really the shift towards regenerative forms of agriculture. And, and we all know how important it, it is how we produce our food and use our soil, etc. Um, but maybe you can talk a bit about more specifically what is regenerative farming and what what are you doing to support that shift? Yeah, absolutely. So regenerative farming is a complete 180 degree change of farming practices. So, so how we are enabling this is to, that we've created a carbon certificate program where we're tracking the farmer's changes year on year then we can quantify each hectare how much carbon is actually sequestered and stored per hectare. And then for each ton of carbon stored in the soil, we can create a carbon certificate that we can then go and sell um, on the voluntary carbon market so that the farmer gets back the, the, um, the financing for this. Yeah, I think it's key to say that farmers have been tilling the soils for more than a thousand years. So changing practices into not tilling the soil and not touching the soil so much is a big investment where they will see yield losses, new machinery is needed, many new practices are needed. And this is where we really become the financing, financing mechanism to make them shift quicker uh, so that we can really help uh, the climate crisis, help solve the climate crisis. Of course. Mm -hmm. That is uh, super interesting. And uh, I mean, we at Chinovic has been very um, impressed by you and the full team throughout this process. Um, so as a last question, why did you choose to partner up with uh, Chinovic? Well, first of all, I think there's an, there's an aligned uh, match in wanting to change the status quo. So uh, we, what we found in, in Chinovic is a really good support um, in us being challenges in in a massive industry. So I think that's uh, first and foremost. And then of course, also a uh, really important note is that we have aligned uh, missions. We want to achieve um, the same things. And, and I think that's really important as this is not just a financial partnership, it's, uh, it's much more than that. And, and hopefully also a very long-term partnership. Hmm. Um, I mean, I couldn't uh, agree more. And thank you so much uh, for today and, and looking forward uh, working together. Thank you. Thank you. Likewise. Likewise.